So this brings us to It Hits the Fam. This is a 2001 episode where South Park says, and you see the little ticker, it says, shit, 162 times. Um, at the time, there was an episode of, of Chicago Hope, um, which was, I believe, an NBC show. I, I believe it was a network TV show um, that said the word shit. And it was like made into an amazingly huge, major, big, big, big deal. Okay. Um, uh, so they say shit a bunch. You have Mr. Garrison who finally says the F word um, and he breaks the fourth wall by, by saying that. So you start to have that word used a little bit more um, uh, on South Park. I don't believe they had used that um, before that. And Mr. Garrison, he breaks the fourth wall, that, that invisible wall between us that I'm breaking right now, um, you know, in, in that episode as well. HBC is a parody of NBC, which was the, um, the network that ran the Chicago Hope uh, episode. So it puts profanity in context. So there's a scene in this, uh, uh, you know, you should have seen, which was Miss Chokes on Dick, who says, you know, shit is as a noun or adjective meaning bad, or as an exclamation of disappointment, the word is acceptable. But as a noun or adjective referring to feces, it is unacceptable. So again, this has to do with like indecency and profanity and context. And so in the context of South Park, it's legal, it's free speech. Um, but if you talk about shit to describe feces, it's, it's considered not free speech. It's considered indecent or profane. Um, but if you use it as an adjective, um, meaning bad or, you know, whatever, it's, it's legal. So it's pretty interesting. So it's making fun of FCC um, indecency standards, basically making fun of how the FCC isn't clear on what is what, okay? Um, the interesting thing, though, is that Comedy Central did not allow them to say the word shit until season 15. So I believe this was season four? I believe that this was season four. Um, so Comedy Central, again, as a self-censoring uh, organization, did not allow this word to be used um, until later. I think it's just pretty funny um, how they, you know, uh, you know, they, it's like there's a curse on the on the curse words. You know, there's a play play on that. Um, you know. Uh, but yeah, it's just I don't know. It's just an interesting take on what is profane. Uh, and what is indecent, and again, using the context, just like George Carlin used uh, indecent words um, to make a commentary on indecency uh, and profanity laws, etc., uh, uh, in TV and in the media, um, South Park did did the same thing. So, anyways, that's a little bit about censorship. It kind of gets us like the basic gist of censorship. We've seen how South Park addresses it in a few of its episodes and how they deal with it, everything from uh, uh, you know, profanity and indecency um, to government censorship, um, which obviously South Park hasn't experienced here, but just abroad. Um, and as we move through some other topics, specifically when we get to religion, we'll see how um, other ways in which Comedy Central has censored um, Matt and Trey's uh, uh, portrayal of religious figures or other celebrities um, and how they've, they've censored um, episodes. Anyways, that's week seven, day one. We're almost done with this. I'm so ready to be fucking done with this video camera shit. I'm so sorry. Last week, our last lecture, I was out of focus. Hopefully, I'm doing better this week. Um, but I hope you're well. Hope you're feeling good. Hope to see you at our Monday crappy hour at five o'clock. I hope you're taking care of y'all selves, getting some exercise and fresh air, staying healthy and, and, and staying well. Uh, I'm the real Dr. Dre. I will catch you on the flip where we talk about corporations and control uh, and how that's expressed in South Park. All right, peace.